Regis Museum. Now one of the most fascinating fossils in this museum is an ichthyosaur where we can see its entire contents of its last meal fossilised in its stomach. Some of the contents of its stomach are really quite bizarre. They're these tiny minuscule hooks but in order to discover which animal they came from we've got to go a little bit further back to actually have a look at that creature itself. Deep in the Jurassic Seas the ichthyosaurs were fearsome predators, eating all sorts of quite incredible and strange creatures that they came across. One of these creatures was called a belemnite, and this squid-like creature was proliferous in the Jurassic Seas. In fact, if you walk across the beaches at Charmouth and Lyme Regis, the belemnite fossils are the ones that are the most likely that you'll walk away with. There's an example of a belemnite fossil here in this drawer. And when we look at it, we can understand why it was such a tasty treat for the ichthyosaur. Belemnites are squid-like creatures with streamlined body shapes. But what's really interesting is at the head of the body, they have these large tentacles which would have reached out to any prey swimming past because these creatures were carnivorous. The tiny hooks on the tentacles of these belemnites were made out of a chemical called chitin. Now if this belemnite was unfortunately dinner for an ichthyosaur that was swimming past, quite often what would happen would be that belemnite would be swallowed whole and end up in the stomach of that creature. Because these hooks were made out of this fairly resistant material called chitin, those hooks actually became trapped in the lining of the stomach of the creature itself. What's quite remarkable is that Lyme Regis Museum has a specimen of an ichthyosaur with its stomach contents entirely fossilised. If we look closely at that stomach, we can see tiny, tiny pieces of these tentacle hooks from these belemnites lodged in the stomach lining. Here's another example of the fossilised internal organs of an ichthyosaur. These brown tubular-like structures are actually the fossilised intestines. It's extraordinary to think that we can see what this creature had for dinner 200 million years later. So the next time you're devouring your fast food, have a think back to our poor ichthyosaur who was fossilised with his entire stomach contents preserved. Imagine what your stomach might look like in 200 million years time. <laughs>